Hello and welcome back to Simple Things Done Right. I'm Harry. I'm Gemma. And today we're doing a box swap. We sent a box of goodies over to Completely Family to do a box swap with them and we've just received our parcel here. Very heavy. <laughs> Quite heavy, yeah. So what we're going to do is we're going to open it up, see what goodies we've got and go from there. Gemma will be off camera because she's a bit camera shy so you won't see her in camera but you will hear her. I to get this over. We do, we do apologise if you can hear dog chewing in the background. We'll have, we've had to give him a uh, chew to keep him occupied. First of all I can see a letter. Huge thanks for you thinking of our family. We have the best time getting to try so many new things. We hope you enjoy trying some of ours. We thought it would be fun to do a taste comparison with the Pepsi. The directions for preparation is written on all the packaging for the food. From the US to the UK, we hope you have the best day completely family. Oh, that's amazing. <laughs> wow, thanks. So first of all, I can see some maple and brown sugar oatmeal. What, they do sashayed oatmeal as well over yeah. there, like porridge. Can have a look. Ah, that would be really interesting because we have um, like, what do we call we it? We have maple oatmeal, but never maple and brown sugar. No, never maple and brown sugar, but what's ours, like what's the brand name here? Quakers. Quakers oats. No. Oh. Quakers. Yeah, but there's like a name for it after. Yeah, that's it. Quakers. There's that's not. a brand. There's not. It is. Oh, yeah, in the little sachets they're called something. I'll put it oats on the screen. Oats so script. simple. Yeah, oats so simple. We also have a pack of Reese's white peanut butter cups. Very nice. <laughs> We have actually had these, but I wonder if they'll be different. We don't get them often here, do we? No. It's a very rare thing to see them here. The white ones. Oh, we might put them in the fridge. <laughs> yeah, I think some of this will need going in the fridge before we test tie. We've got some Hostess Twinkies. <laughs> you like these, don't you? I think have so. Have we ever had them that big, though? No. Like they're usually smaller, aren't they? Yeah. They're not like a regular thing in the UK. These no. Are just like it's a once in a blue moon you'll ever see them if you're lucky. And they're like B and M and things where they've yeah. got the American section, aren't they? Yeah. We have some chocolate cake Twinkies. You ever had them? No. Interesting for you to try. Oh, I see some for Tyson in here. What? We have some <gasps> dentist stick. Bacon flavour for oh, the dog. That is so sweet that they've sent Tyson something. Wow. I've never heard of bacon flavour in dentistry before. No, I haven't. That's amazing. Oh, it's really touched me. How kind. Mm, yeah. Let's not show him them at the minute though. Cause oh. <laughs> we'll hide them. <laughs> He'll come sniffing in a minute when he finishes chew. We have some snowballs, which... It's something I've always wanted to try. Are they not like our snowballs? No. Why are they blue? I don't know. What is that them? Blue? Well, these are definitely going to have to go in the fridge, these, aren't they? Yeah. Oh, well. It's no issue. We have some Hershey's dark chocolate. Dark Hershey's? Have you ever tried that? No. I'm trying not to, like, um, mould anything too badly so it, it like... Oh, Tyson's finished his snack. He's come for the chocolate. Now, we have down and be a good boy. some Hostess Ding Dongs. A bit battered in the packaging. Ding Dongs? What are they? I don't know. They couldn't have helped this though. Like, no. postage was awful for them. Yeah. Like, they paid like a lot more for than us for postage. And it yeah. took like eight times as long. Yeah. <laughs> that'll, that'll be fine once it's gone in the fridge. All tastes the same anyway, won't it? Yes. Oh, that's, there's something in here I've just noticed that you'll love. What? It's one of your favourite things. 
We have <gasps> slushy poppy strawberry. You have to freeze it first. What? Do we have this here? And we have a second one for me. <laughs> do we? Do we have this here? No. Like in the pouch. No. Are you sure it gets frozen? Yeah, it says on the back. Literally, the closest thing to this is a frozen alcohol slushy. We do. Yeah, yeah. Is it by Smirnoff or something like yeah. that? Yeah. Wow. That's amazing. I'd much rather have one that's not got alcohol in it, to be fair. The alcohol one is nice, but you can't beat an original slushy. We don't drink probably. much, though, do we? No. So it's nice to have something that's not alcohol. -y. We have the American version of our Smarties. Which aren't smarties to us, they're fizzies. Tyson, lie down, boy. Oh, so embarrassing. Tyson, lie down. Stop it. He wants all the food, doesn't he? Yeah. So what are these like, sorry? The fizzers, or whatever they're yeah, called, that we sent we over. Yeah, we sent them. Oh. I think we've explained this, that smarties to us. We didn't send them smarties, did no, we? No, smarties to us are chocolate covered in a sugar coat, sugar shell. Sugar shell, yeah. Hmm. We have some Blimey, how much stuff Sweet in Smells it? Kids Pack Deluxe. What? What I can see is Double Bubble, Jaw Breakers, Tiger Pops, Assorted Fruit Chews, Smarties, Tongue Toucher Candies, Airheads, Warheads, and Tootsie Mini Midgets. What are they like? Just like a assorted pack? Yeah. Wow, oh, that's cool. We will be trying, well, Harry will be trying these on camera. Um, have your che have the Cheetos popped open? Oh, yeah. <laughs> you know oh, what? Well. That happened to, um, in fact, I'm sure it was Cheetos as well. That happened to Half Blood Pixie. But she still tried them. So I I'll still to, try them. Yeah, you can try them like, in a minute. Yeah. See if they sale. Um, yeah, so what was, I gonna say, what was I saying before? We will be doing like a selection of like episodes. We will taste test some in different episodes because we don't want to keep the video rolling too long because it might get a bit boring for you guys. So like we'll do we'll do like three or four items like to taste test like a couple of times a week something yeah. like that. We have sweet smells orange slices. Looks a bit like our sort of fruit pastel sort of things. Oh, they do, don't they? Wow. We also have some cow cow minis. Have you ever had them? I've never had these, but according to Completely Family, they're a bit like our fudge, Cadbury's fudge. Oh, they did, didn't they? That's what they said. Yeah, vanilla. What, vanilla flavour? Yeah. Cool. I wonder if these need to go in the fridge. Do you think there's something that needs to go in? I don't, want to, I don't want to ruin stuff by putting it in and making it go rock hard. No. Oh, we'll ask in a bit, shall we? We have some fun dip, which I think looks a bit like dib dabs. We did we send them a dib dab? Yes, we did. Oh, they'll have to tell us if. Oh, actually, we'd know ourselves, wouldn't we? But that does look just like it. Look like nicer flavours than us. Yeah. <laughs> looks like they get a more of variety. Yeah. And we've got some pixie sticks. I've heard of them. I've no idea what they are. I think it's sherbet in tubes. Oh, like rainbow sherbet straws. That we yeah. Have. I can't... Have we seen them for ages? I haven't seen them for a while. I think they're selling them in the old sweet shop in town. They were like the... Um, it says candy filled fun straws though. Yeah. Thoughtful... I'm not so sure about them. That would be interesting. Yeah. About what, what's inside them. We have some Jiffy Corn Muffin Mix. What? Be interesting to try that. <laughs> that's a... Um, Lug of bread. That's a Foodie Friday, Foodie Friday episode. Sort oh, of maybe. definitely. Yeah. We'll have to do that for Foodie Friday. We have some peanut butter and jelly. I look at the smile on your face. You really... Is that the grape one? Yeah. <laughs> What do we have one similar like Goober or something like that? Is it called? I think so, but you can't get it often, can you? No, it's only in specialist shops. And it doesn't look as like that. Looks like real fruits. Yeah. Wow, you're excited about that, yeah. aren't you? 
Next up is some Twizzlers strawberry flavour. What's the um? What's it called about them? Whether red vines or Twizzlers are better or something. Yeah. You can use these to suck up a juice, can't you? I think so. I've seen some that you'll love. <laughs> we have Easy Cheese. <gasps> no! Now, Gemma's been wanting to try this for absolutely ages since she saw it. Didn't we order this on like um, a shop we did once? It had a few like American things on. Yeah. And it didn't come, did it? Didn't no. they say it was out of stock? Yeah. Wow. We have some... Firework Oreos with popping candy. What? What flavour are they then? Firework Oreos with popping candy. I heard that, but like, is it just like plain Oreo with popping candy? I think it's candy normal in? Oreos with popping candy in. This is, like, show that back. This is amazing, like how... See, we don't get them like this. We get them in long tubular tubes and you get about 12 cookies in it. And it's quite difficult for like packaging afterwards but that's like resealable yeah and it's quite tidy you won't make a mess i was thinking resealable what do you need it to be resealable for <laughs> right what's this we have pepsi wow we went all out didn't they Look at the, the branding name on the front's different. Yeah, it's a completely different design. This is a retro design. What flavour? Is it like a... Um, it's a normal it Pepsi. Pepsi. No, full fat. Oh, cool. Well, I say full fat, full sugar. Ah. You can carry on. This will be interesting to see if it's different. We have some Kraft macaroni and cheese. <laughs> See, we had this argument, not argument, but discussion, didn't we? About whether we've had Kraft mac and cheese before. You don't think we have? No. I think we have, but maybe we haven't and it's just been similar. Oh, we have two mac and cheese. <laughs> awesome. Isn't that funny that, Harry, isn't that funny we did mac and cheese as our video last week? Yeah. And he'd already sent this box out. Yeah. Sorry, I know I keep saying he, they, sorry. They had already sent this box out. I think we might have to buy a microwave from Microwave Popcorn. <laughs> the story is we did have a microwave, but it like blew up, didn't it? Yeah. Like full on set on fire. Oh, this is for butter lovers. Cool. No harm getting a microwave back, is there? No. And these last quite a while anyway until we get one, don't they? Yeah. April 19. We've got ages. We have some Flaming Hot Crunchy Cheetos. No, they're the ones that we requested. Is that more of them? Or is the bottom broke as well? Yep. Just leave yeah. it there. It's actually the same, yeah. At least one. one They're still crunchy. Time. Oh, have you just tried it? Yeah. Mmm. Woo! What? <laughs> Ow! <laughs> wow! Can I try one? Are they are they actually bright red? Show that to the camera. We don't have bright red stuff like that. Like try crisps, that. Do we? Wow! If he said it's spicy, it must be because I don't do spice, do I? No. Wait for it. It's more once it goes down. Well, they're so flavourful though. It's really burning me. <laughs> Can we just continue please? Yeah. We have some Slim Jims, which I've heard of but never tried. I think they're similar to our pepperoni. Pepperamis. Oh really? No way. But we have to keep ours in the fridge, don't we? Yeah. It's made with beef, pork and chicken. We have some toasty pastries. What? Now this looks like a different brand from what we're used to. No, no, they have that brand as well, don't they? No, we don't have this brand. No, 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 but they... Yeah, they have pop tart as yeah. well. Oh, but it's a different brand of them. Yeah. Oh, we've had the... And we've got fudge as well. We've had the... Um... 
We've had the fudge and the small flavour pop tarts recently, haven't we? Yeah. So this will be really nice to compare. You know what? Them crisps were actually really nice. Like I might tip them into a bowl so we can just snack yeah. on them all day. Yeah, they were really nice. Like the flavour, like even though it's hot, it goes. Like usually when I have something too spicy, it'll stay on yeah. And I've not even had to have a drink. Oh my god. We have some Nestle Butterfingers. What stuff they've sent that we literally don't have. What's next? We have some <laughs> Lucky Charms. Now, we used to have these in Britain. Maybe 20... I don't know the time frame. At years least 20 ago. years ago, I'd say. But they got discontinued in Britain because of a high amount of sugar. What were they replaced with, though, that you can get occasionally? That's only just recently come out. They completely got rid of anything like this because it was too high in sugar for kids to eat. Oh, right. What, what's, um, what's the ones they, we, we sometimes get? Magic? No? Um. Anyway, there's a UK type version. Yeah. But I don't know if I've ever had actual Lucky Charms. Have you ever had them with me? No. I've never had them then. They've got magical unicorn marshmallows, have they? <laughs> now, this is one I was going to send them, but I didn't think that they had it, but they do. Beef ravioli. Whoa, they do? This will be so interesting to see if it's different Now, to we ours. have beef ravioli over here, but it's done by Heinz. Well, you can get it from... You like... can get it in different brands and that, but the most popular one is Heinz. But that's just in a tomato sauce. I think I've heard That it. says it's in a tomato and meat sauce. Oh, yeah. Which will be an interesting one to try. It's kind of like a ravioli bolognese, isn't it? Yeah. Cool. Awesome. Now, what's left is all different little bits. So I'm just going to grab them all out of this box and put them in front of me and we'll look at it all together. Just dropped loads of stuff on the floor. Get rid of the box. We have some Mike and Ike's original fruits. Mm. I love anything that makes that noise in a box. Yeah. Nice little shake. We have some taco seasoning. Cool. I wonder if that's different to what we've tried. So we do have old El Paso, Paso taco, but it might be different. Might be. We'll have to get an old old taco paso, old old paso taco seasoning, Compare. and do a taste comparison. Yeah, we will do that. Hundred percent. Wow, we got the <laughs> sloppy joes. We have to try this. That's amazing. It's going to make a lot of sloppy joes, though. I mean, we've attempted to make our own before, haven't we? Sort yeah. Of. But it's never really. We don't know whether it's been authentic. Awesome. It's hard for us because when we look up American recipes, a lot of it uses certain seasonings and that, and ingredients. which we don't have in the UK, which we have to try and then adjust the recipe to suit the UK stuff we go for, we buy. So therefore, it probably doesn't taste as good as the American version would be. That's true. So we can't really make a good comparison, could we? We have some sweet tarts. I always thought they were called... Do you know when people say them? Yeah. On American television stuff. I thought they say sweet tarts. Is that another thing they've got? I don't know. Or are they saying sweet tarts and I just think they're saying sweet tarts? They're sour. That's up your street. We've got some more... Taco and popcorn. Taco and popcorn. Oh, is this Kool-Aid? I believe so. <laughs> so we have a pink lemonade Kool-Aid. Wow. We have a lemonade Kool-Aid. We have two grape Kool-Aids. We love grape. I think Finley knows that. Yeah, Harry especially loves grape. We have blue raspberry lemonade. Ooh. Ooh that will sound. That sounds interesting. We have Tropical Punch. We also have Black Cherry. And we also have Normal Cherry. 
Now that's it for the box. We're going to leave it there because we're already pushing 20 minutes. We just want to say we are so, so grateful for all of this stuff. This is amazing. And there will be up and coming videos that like, do a bit of taste testing of them. We'll let you know. And we're just so grateful for all the time and energy you put into doing this with us. And we've had a blast. It's been amazing, hasn't it? Yes, it has. So if you liked what you saw, can you leave us a thumbs up? If there's anything you'd like to see in the future, leave a comment down below. And if it's not too much to ask, maybe a cheeky subscription. Oh, one more thing before we go. Um, we'll put Completely Family's channel. They've got a new channel. We'll put it at the end of this. Yep. In the little logo next to ours. And we'll put it in the link in our description. Just you can go and check them out because they're an amazing family. And yeah. As always, keep, keep it, it simple. simple.